Welcome to Program Designer Pro. Today I'm going to show you the features of our Ad Creator tool. Ad Creator is a specific application that we've developed to work hand in hand with our program book layout tool. With our desktop software open and the home tab selected, in the left navigation you can go to Ad Creator. Our software has predefined ad templates for business card size ad, eighth, quarter, half, and full page ads. These tabs here will create an ad specifically sized to those templates. So you will not have to worry about resizing or any content that you make getting cut off uh, when you place your ad in the program. For ease of use of this, because I'm going to show you several functions and features, I'm going to do a full page ad and I'm going to start a new design. This will bring up a template that is perfectly sized for our full page template in Program Designer Pro. Some of the functions that you're going to see here now, uh, you can zoom, which will make the ad uh, visibly larger, not the actual end size, but visibly if you wanted to zoom in and see something in more detail, or you can zoom out. We have a text creator, which will bring a text box on your empty canvas that you can drag around and size accordingly. You can highlight the text and you can type in whatever you'd like to appear in your ad or in that text line. If you highlight that text you can make it bold, italic, and we have center, right, and left justification as well. Along with that you can come up to text size and fonts and you can change the font size to whatever you wish along with the font type. We have some predefined font faces loaded into the software uh, that you can change the font type to. Now currently our font is black. If we reselect this again and highlight it, we can go to our color picker. We can click on any color in the gamut that we wish to select and it'll change that font to that color. Now maybe this color blue is not what I really wanted so I'll go back in and now within that color I have a slide bar on the side that I can make it darker or lighter and when I choose to do that it'll change the font color to whatever I selected. We have a line tool that you can draw a line in Program Designer Pro and you can drag it wherever you'd like and make it as long or as thick as you'd like. The color picker works the same for the line tool as it does for the text tool. Um, and right now, the color that we selected for text is still populated in our box. So if we wanted the line the same color, all we have to do is select this box on the left and it'll turn our line exactly the same color as the text. We also have a box tool that we can create a solid or an outline box. So we create a solid box and again you could drag it wherever you'd like. You can make it as long as you'd like. If you would like to put the box behind the text, you can drag it over the text and these two buttons up here, send to back, bring to front, will take whatever you have selected and do just that. So we want to send this box behind the text. So we're going to say send to back. And now you can see the text now appears in our box and we can make this white if we'd like so it stands out better. And you could do some unique things with your ad with that function. So the send to back bring to front function works with anything that is selected. So we could send this line behind the black box by just clicking send to back. Another very unique feature that we have in Program Designer Pro is our QR code builder. If you click QR code you can come in here and type in a web address hit embed, 
and now you have a live QR code that any smartphone can read as long as they have a QR reader on it and it will take them to whatever website you typed in the builder so if you if you do have a QR scanner on your phone you can scan this right now and it'll take you to sports program printing website this is a very unique feature that we have in our ad creator tool that is very specific to program designer pro along with that we have an import function that you can import JPEGs uh, or PDF files this is also nice because our program designer pro layout does it only takes JPEG files so you may have an ad that's sent to you in a PDF file well you can import it into one of the templates and save it as a JPEG so it works perfectly with program designer pro so I'm going to show you if you click import it'll bring up a locator box just like uh, any other program would on your computer you find the file you'd like to import and you could just double click or select it and it'll bring that file in and now you can resize that to any size you'd like and you can also drag this around however you'd like the delete function is primarily for our text boxes but if you have something selected and you don't want to hit the delete key on your keyboard you can select it and hit the delete key up in the corner to save your file hit save we have two options you could save as draft I would recommend this if you're going to have to come back and make changes to your file this is the only way that you'll be able to make changes if you save final you will not be able to make changes to that file and you'll have to recreate the entire file from scratch so if you select save draft it'll bring up a .txt file and you can save this on your desktop wherever you'd like and the same thing if you say save final it will bring up a .jpg file which will save your final image to wherever you choose on your computer when you're done you can hit close and it'll bring you back to your main screen we have two more buttons over here one is change ad size so say you started out with one size but you want to go back and, and uh, maybe a, a, an advertiser changed their mind you can hit change ad size and then reselect what size ad you'd like to change to and it'll rechange the canvas here which will output you know that specific size ad now if there was anything outside of this ad say in the full page uh, original ad that I created it will be gone so you do have to replace that and re-upload the images if you wanted to scrap this and start entirely over you can click start new and it'll bring you right back to the main screen now this button here open design is if you were to save a draft and you wanted to reopen that draft to make changes you would click open design and then you would find that .txt file wherever you had saved it for the draft and select that and it would open the ad just as it was when you saved it that's the functionality in our ad creator tool for Program Designer Pro from Sports Program Printing.